What's up everybody? This is Mommy Watton. I am back with another channel message. I hope everyone is doing good. After that last video, actually that video had kind of um, upset me a little bit. Um, the levels that people will go to um, to do things, but I cleared my energy and I'm back as promised to deliver channel messages to my subscribers, to my listeners, because I see how y'all been tapping in. I do feel the energy, okay? So we're going to see what the Holy Spirit wants us to know. We had three cards right off the top. We got the good Lord, the house, and murky thoughts. Hmm. What I just heard was, is that somebody found out that they've been being cheated on while they could be at work all day, okay? Um, they've been at this house here. This is what I'm getting from this good Lord, the house, and this murky thoughts. What else do you want us to know about this Holy Spirit? What else? Is that it? That might be it, y'all. We talking about the good Lord, the house, and murky thoughts. I just feel like y'all know what the good Lord card, that's what I say whenever I see this card, this woman begging this man not to leave her. And the good Lord can stand for a scorned lover, somebody who's coming in to lay down the law, to address or confront an issue, of unfaithfulness or infidelity or something that someone has done wrong, okay? And we have the house and we have murky thoughts. So something went down in this house. I'm going to say that. I don't know if it means somebody was necessarily cheating, but something went down in this house between these two people. So we're going to find out what in the hell is going on, okay? <laughs> That's what we about to do. All right. So, Holy Spirit, what would you like for us to know about the good Lord, the house, and murky thoughts? But I'm going to tell y'all, I got to say this about that reading I did earlier. Because that shit's sitting heavy on me. But what's sitting heavy on me is the... The level of judgment that, that that married couple that's on drugs that was doing that shit, they about to face some heavy judgment. That's that's the the pillar on my chest regarding that situation, that energy I picked up on. So don't worry about it. If you was if that read made you feel some type of way too, don't even worry about it. Okay. But what would you like for us to know about this energy, Holy Spirit? Let's go. We have the Six of Swords. I'm telling y'all, somebody done walked away. Possibly a, a Scorpio here with this death card. Somebody walked away and put a death to this relationship here that I'm picking up. Okay, we. what did I say? I just talked about judgment, but I feel like this couple is currently under judgment here. You know what, y'all? This may be a continuation off them people I did pick up on earlier, this married couple here. Mm. It looks like, hmm. Looks like one of the partners, the masculine, is holding himself back now from this scheme or plot. Whatever was going on that these two people, whatever was popping off on this house, in this house, this man then left, okay? That's, that's what's going on here. This man then left her, 444 on the phone. He is currently judging her. I don't know what was discovered in this house, but now she is really in 
her head real bad. She's in, definitely in some type of nine of wands energy with this murky thoughts because this Scorpio death energy has walked away from this relationship. He is no longer giving to this relationship and he is currently passing judgment on this feminine here. Oh yeah. She feeling it here. This def this strength card definitely giving off murky thoughts. Possibly a water sign. She's definitely in her in her feelings and her emotions right now. This Queen of Cups energy. Okay? We got two water signs out here. This woman feels stuck. She don't know what to do because whatever he hit her with, whatever info he hit her with, with on this good Lord card, whatever he confronted her about, she was not able to recover from that. She was not able to give him a valid answer about what she had been doing in this house, y'all. Something has been going on in this house. This man found out about it. And he bounced and she upset. That's where we at. I hope everybody following me. I know I had a slow start, but here we go. Who? What happened in this house, Holy Spirit? We got the four swords. Okay, so you already know that she, I'm picking up that she had other men in this house. But we're going to clarify. Clarify this four swords, Holy Spirit. We have justice. <clears throat> we got judgment and justice out here now. Now, I do believe this is the couple that I was picking up on earlier. These motherfuckers, okay? I'm going to just go ahead and admit it to myself. That's what I'm hearing. I didn't want to fucking read on these ignorant assholes, but I'm going to read on them because God wants us to know something about these two people, okay? What this energy found out is that this woman been doing something to get justice in a situation. I do feel like the woman is primarily who has been making someone sick. I'm still picking up on that energy from earlier. But what I'm picking up now is that this couple here the man didn't know to the what the full extent was. He didn't know the full extent of what this Queen of Cups was doing. This Queen of Cups been trying to make somebody pass to get justice somehow. That's what I'm picking up. I don't care what nobody say. That's what the hell's I'm picking up. She has been doing possibly some damn root work or something in that house. And that man then figured it out. He figured out that she was trying to make somebody pass. She was trying to get justice by causing some type of death. I don't care what nobody say. Queen of Pentacles and this Ace of Cups. Because what I was picking up from that other reading was these people were going through it. They had then took some losses. They had had some terror moments. And they was trying to get back into this, to this abundant energy. This Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Cups energy here. Okay. This is what she was trying to do. She was trying to take somebody out here. I don't care what nobody say. And her man found out about it. And now he has his guard up to her with this seven of wands. That's why he, why we had, we got judgment, justice, six of swords and death out here. He ain't fucking with her. And she broken hearted about it. I'm telling y'all, I'm picking up that this is the same energy from earlier. But this man did not know everything that this woman was doing behind the scenes to cause this ending. What else would you like for us to know, Holy Spirit? Her ass was in that house doing something with this Page of Cups energy that he discovered. 
that he like, this is just too much for me. I can't be a part of this, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Like I said, whatever scheme that she was doing, whatever plot she was doing on this energy that I picked up on earlier, who was this this um, Queen of Cups doing this plotting against, Holy Spirit? Who is this Queen of Cups plotting against? We have the Two of Pentacles. Clarify the Two of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Who? We have the Nine of Swords. Okay, she definitely was trying to get somebody out of whack, throw their life out of balance, and to have them in this Nine of Swords energy. Have them in the bed sick, okay? Did this. We have the two of wands, and as they do, these hoes like to sit up and watch and see if this bullshit that they do works, but it don't generally give off the effect that they were hoping for. They might get a little bit of action, but it ain't nothing that, like I said, they might get a little bit of action with the seven of pentacles here, but it ain't nothing that's going to make none shake 11-11 on the phone, okay? This is what she been doing. And she has been discovered by her partner. I feel like he did not know. I'm telling you, they've been talking about it. Thank y'all for sharing that video. Okay? It's helping me expose these motherfuckers. Because see, what's been happening is, they done, somebody done watched my video. And now they scrambling. This is the energy that I'm picking up here. So one of these partners, possibly the masculine in this situation, watched my video and started putting two to, and two together and got four both ways, okay? And he confronted this feminine, this Queen of Cups water sign. This Scorpio confronted this feminine about what she was doing in this house to cause what I picked up on earlier, 12-12 on the phone, okay? That's what I'm seeing here. And he done left her ass, they fell out. He may not have fully left and moved out, but he left her, okay? And he's currently judging her for whatever he discovered that she has been doing against this elderly person to try to make sure that she is back in this Queen of Cups and this Ace of Cups energy. Okay. Mm. What's gonna happen with this situation, Holy Spirit? What I, I we see we have the Ace of Wands. <clears throat> she finna have a new beginning, all right, possibly in a damn jail cell. What else, Holy Spirit? We got the Queen of Swords in reverse. I'm telling y'all what's then happen is, and she's some type of shapeshifter, old face head ass energy too, because she out here is the Queen of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, and now the Queen of Swords in reverse. Y'all can't tell me that this woman, and it was just 1333 on the phone, this woman been out here plotting and scheming, trying to speed up somebody's death so that her and her man could come up because they had been facing hardships and stuff and they got drug problems. But I do not believe this masculine, this death energy, this Scorpio here, he did not know how deep this Queen of Swords in reverse was into this plot and scheme to harm this person, okay? I feel like he didn't realize. I do feel like he was in that same energy, 1414 on the phone of, well, yeah, this person about to pass soon, so I'm about to be rich, okay? I feel like he may have told her that. But I don't think that he realized that she was gonna take that information and go and try to speed up this person's death. We had the Four of Swords and we had Justice when I asked what this damn Queen of Cups was doing, okay? What, what had happened? And this is literally what came out. She was trying to kill somebody. She was trying to put somebody down. I don't care what you say. And she possibly 
was conjuring up this type of energy and these spells in this house, okay? Or either this is the house that this elderly person who is sick resides in. Clarify this house card, Holy Spirit. My nose just started itching too. Clarify this house card, Holy Spirit. And I feel like he didn't think that she could be that devious, that evil. With this murky thoughts card, I'm telling y'all, he did not think that his woman could be that sinister. And this shit really got him thinking hard about the truth of the matter. Because again, I, I picked up that these people was on drugs and I feel like this masculine's brain has got clouded. And it's possible that his brain has gotten clouded because she been putting some magic on his ass too. With this Queen of Swords in reverse here. Okay. And the Holy Spirit also said, what I'm saying is the truth. Because I was, you know, 16, 16 on the phone. I was starting to feel some type of way. Like, really? But it's good to see that both of these motherfuckers was not involved in this plot to take this person out for their inheritance. Because that's what this woman was trying to do. And I, like I said, I believe the masculine watched my video and his ass tapped in a little bit and was like, hold up, this is sounding too familiar. But he knew he wasn't out here trying to do no black magic to kill nobody, but he knew he had then told his wife, his partner, that he was possibly about to inherit some money when this elderly person passed. That's what I'm picking up, okay? And she took that information and she started working on this sick person, making them sicker, trying to speed up their death so that they could get this money. 1717 on the phone. But her, this Scorpio energy did not know that she was doing all of that. That's what I'm getting here. Any final messages, Holy Spirit? And she is currently up under judgment. She's up under judgment. She's up under, up under judgment by him for sure. Okay. But I feel like something is, is he's something is else is going to happen with this. I feel like we got the King of Pentacles and we got the Four of Wands. This King of Pentacles is going to be all right. He going to celebrate. He's still going to get that inheritance. 1808 on the phone. Okay. That's what I'm picking up here. But I don't think he's going to be sharing it with this Queen of Pentacles. Or maybe he is. Who knows? Because like I said, these people got drug issues. So they may feel like, you know, he may feel like he going to go and stick in there with her. Because of the, the amount of devilment that she been doing that he knows about and he don't want to be found out about because he married to a type of energy like this. That's what I'm picking up. So he trying to save face. He may. He may go on ahead and rock with the plan, y'all. That's sad. Nope. He ain't rocking with the plan. Thank you, Holy Spirit. There's some common sense that's starting to kick in with these motherfuckers. Because this is what it said earlier. That they needed to walk away from this scheme that they had to try to speed up this person's death for their money. And I feel like this is what this uh, masculine's doing. He's walking away from this energy and her scheme to try to speed up this person's death. Because I feel like it's somebody in his family. This ain't even her damn family member. This is somebody in his family that they're doing this to, that she was doing this to specifically, okay? But he didn't walk away from her. And I feel like, I mean, if he if he was rightfully owed an inheritance based off of somebody passing for, from natural causes, that's cool. I ain't got no problem with that. So if he didn't have it, if he ain't had nothing to do with this person being sick and he's been truly doing the right thing by this person, 
who is about he's about to inherit this money from, I'm not gonna knock him for coming out as the King of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. But if he is involved with this woman in any way, shape, or form doing this, he gonna pay too now. I'm telling you. But the energy that I'm getting is that he didn't know that she was out here doing that. But I do feel like this man done walked away from this woman. And that he going to keep his inheritance and his fortune to himself with this nine of cups here. That's what I'm picking up. He may celebrate with somebody else, but he sure ain't going to be celebrating with her. Mm. Any final messages you want us to know, Holy Spirit? Man, I didn't even want to read on this when I started picking up that energy. But I think it's good to see that. Both of their ass ain't crazy, okay? Both of them ain't lost their damn mind. And I'm telling y'all, this man walking away from this bullshit, he walking away from this woman, this Queen of Cups energy, this shapeshifter, he leaving her alone because he didn't got wind of what she been doing to cause this person's passing, okay? She thought if she was attached to him, and this person passes 2121 on the phone that if she married to them, when they get this money, that she going to get the money too. Okay. And now what I also am picking up is, I'm also picking up that this Queen of Cups energy wants her Scorpio, her, her partner, her husband got that inheritance. That he was next on the chopping block, okay? Why he thinking he doing something with this Queen of Cups energy? She plotting and scheming on him next. He was next up, okay? 2202 on the phone. I can't make it up. I didn't even see this on the bottom. I'm telling y'all, this damn masculine Scorpio energy, you need to get away from this water sign. If you done left, you need to stay away from her. Because after she got rid of this elderly person in your family that is sick and you inherited that money, she was going to take your ass out next, okay? Play with it if you want to. I can't make it up. She was going to take you out next, big baby. Look, look, look what then came out. Look, I can't, y'all, I can't make it up. I can't make it up. Look at this shit. Look at what just came out. We got the Ten of Swords, Temperance, Five of Pentacles, Hierophant, the Emperor. This is you, okay, Scorpio? The Devil came out after that. The Five of Cups and then the Fool. I'm going to go and break it down for you. Okay, and then I'm going to wrap this shit on up right here because I'm telling you, you next, buddy. You think you and this woman doing something. You think y'all together, y'all Bonnie and Clyde type energy and shit. No, sir. She going to take you out right after she take this other person out. We got the Ten of Swords. This woman is going to take you out once she balances this situation. Once this other person passes and y'all receive that money. She is going to do whatever she need to do to either take you out, destroy you, or have you in the five of pentacles by divorcing your ass. With this hierophant energy here, she finna take your money, whether she kill your ass or she take you to divorce court. Okay, emperor here, because you, you married to a whole demon out here in these streets. This devil energy, and you are gonna be in regret for continuing to take a risk with this devil here, this demon, this queen of cups energy, okay? And I'm dropping the mic on that because that's definitely what I was picking up. You keep fucking around this damn bitch if you want to, you gonna be next. And that's all I got to say on that. If it doesn't apply, please let it fly. But I know it do apply to somebody and I thank y'all for expose, helping me expose this energy because shit like this, it needs to stop. It does. This don't even make no damn sense right here. But this is why this Emperor Emperor Scorpio 
ass is up next on the chopping block because I think he he thought he was doing something with this Queen of Cups energy, but he don't even know she she gunning for him next. Well, now he know. I hope this helps somebody, and I'll be back soon with another one. Peace, y'all.